So right now, let's talk about the mechanism and the workflow of uh, of making uh, phishing email addresses. Okay. So the first step right here, we are going to generate hacking uh, hacking scenario phishing template by using the fish uh, the fish mail tool that we already actually have uh, have used before during our training course. And after that, we have to set up our trusted mail server uh, by using our hosting or hosting account. And after that, we will create the phishing subdomains that we talked about earlier. These subdomains, the Facebook subdomains, the YouTube, the Outlook, and in the future also you can do any any phishing subdomain as you want. And after that, we will set up the phishing web pages on our cloud server. And the next step is to redirect our uh, our generated subdomains to our hacking server. And at the end, we will send the phishing email address template successfully. So let's actually start by, by performing all of these steps together. So right here, after our, after I uh, I opened my hosting or hosting account, the first thing I'm going to do right here is to open my is I'm going to uh, to open the Kali Linux machine right here. So this is my Kali Linux virtual machine, and I am inside the the Fishmailer tool uh, directory. So right now I will list all of the files right here and I will type sudo python3 fishmailer.python So right now the script um, of the tool will, will start As you can see this is available uh, the available phishing email templates right here We will go with, uh, with the Facebook one So we'll, we will uh, click uh, number 2 it will ask us uh, what is uh, the target name so the target name will be my name what is the target email so for example let's um, let's make it uh, Mustafa hacker anything okay it's just it's just for having having fun so for this for this point right now it's asking us about what is the phishing URL that we are going to use so of course if we send if we send the normal phishing uh, email address, uh, sorry, the, the 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 phishing URLs as before, the traditional phishing uh, hyperlinks that we generated before, it will be blocked and suspended by Google. So how we can actually bypass something like this? Right now, I'm going to open my my cloud my cloud hacking server right here, okay, and I am navigating to my phishing right here this is my server okay so this is actually uh, my cloud server and this is my and the other in the other hand right here i have my kali linux machine so in the kali linux virtual machine i will generate my my phishing email address template and uh, uh, for for the cloud server i am going to start our phishing web page our phishing hyperlink is that we are going to use inside this email address so how we can actually generate something like this we will we will for example use this tool the MIP 22 and right here I'm going to start the tool I just type the name of the script okay so right now I'm selecting option number one and uh, this is actually is uh, the hacking scenario that I want uh, to use the, um, the Facebook security because uh, also inside inside our um, uh, our our email uh, email phishing uh, generator tool where we will also use the same hacking scenario. So as I told you before, always make your hacking scenario very very um, um, convenient to, to the to the victim. Okay, so it has to be very very convincing. So uh, the victim has uh, uh, has to not, to not feel any suspicious feeling at all. Okay, so if you are going to to trick your victim by sending a security alert email address, so of course the web page that you are going to send to the victim has to also contain the same scenario, not not another scenario. Okay, so right here I am going to use this one. So the tool right now will ask us about what is um, the tunnel service that we are going to use. So I will use the Cloudflare one, number three. 
and wait until the tool generating for us the phishing uh, hyperlinks. Okay, so uh, right now we have uh, we have received the four different uh, phishing hyperlinks right here. Let's use any one of them. So for example, I will use this one. So I will copy this one, and I will enter it right here. So for uh, enter uh, for for the number as the date, let's uh, go with one. What is the month? The first month. What is the year? okay what is the time so of course you have to select a convincing time not any time randomly okay so what is the city anything maybe i will go with roma so which country right here so let's get let's go with italy what is the name of the file that we want to save for example let's um, let's name it Facebook security mail okay so the file has been saved right here so this is our our phishing email address template so right now I'm going to copy this one to the desktop okay So I'm going to to leave for the desktop right here. As you can see, this is this is a file. Our file is the desktop. Let's open this file because it's uh, an HTML file. So I will open it by uh, by typing Firefox following with uh, the file name. Okay. So as you can see right here, we have uh, some problems. The first one is um, the Facebook icon right here is not uh, displayed correctly. So that's meaning the, the hyperlink of this image is not uh, is not exist anymore. And also for the Google Chrome right here, we have the same issue. So how to solve something like this? Actually, it's very easy. And also I know it's something right here. If I do some zoom, I know it's something right here. This, um, this hyperlink tag is not closed. Um, correctly so we have to to fix all of these problems before we send uh, or you uh, are going to use any of these uh, hyperlinks okay or or any of these phishing templates of course so how to fix something like this the first thing you have to do right here is to click on inspect and the click right here on the selector okay so after select uh, click on the selector right here let's select on the port that uh, we uh, we uh, we want to get uh, the source code of and, and as you can see this is the port actually i'm searching for and this is the tag image let's click right click and uh, and choose edit as html and as you can see this is actually the source code inside um, inside this web page that containing the the image source and of course this source uh, this hyperlink of this source is not um, available at this moment because of that we have this uh, this issue so no problem i will take this